junior studying international business at ODU. Um, I'm a fashionista with not just a love for fashion, but a love for sustainable and ethically made fashion. And I currently have nearly a decade and a half experience in the crafting and sewing world. Fashionable, affordable, eco-friendly. That's our motto. That's who we are. Each of our purses is made from recycled upholstery fabric, adding to its durability and stain resistance, while the inside of each purse is made with recycled denim. Now, you may ask, why sustainable? This is why. Fashion is the second most polluting industry in the world. It's second to oil. Second to oil. There are oil rigs and oil swings in the ocean, and there's mini skirts, and mini skirts come in second. That, 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 that amazed me when I found that out. That, um, over 10% of landfill waste is textiles and leather. Textiles can be reworked, re-sewn, reused. There's no need to throw them away. And leather only gets better with age. It's the same sort of situation. There's no need for people to just throw away clothes. Why, you ask? The culprit is fast fashion. It produces disposable, cheap, unethically made clothing that is just so easily tossed, so easily thrown away because it is simply not made well. So are the accessories, the faux leather, the pleather. It looks cute, but frequently it just can't stand the test of time. Now behind the scenes, Too Pink Peas officially started, officially launched in May of 2015, but I had the concept in high school and I came into the center and Nancy gave me some great advice as well as the current grad assistant here. Uh, and the Strom Center has just been an incredible resource for me. I too work out of a shared working space, my office is there and they gave me just a great deal of publicity and space to manufacture on the commuter. And so working out of Virginia Beach just really wasn't an option and they gave me the chance to grow and it's just, it's been amazing. Now the market opportunity. More and more millennial consumers in fashion, they want three things. They want, of course, fashionable. They want it affordable to meet their budget. And more and more, they want it sustainable. They want it ethically made. Most companies only fit two of the three. They do not fit all three. For example, mass retailers, it's fashionable, it might be affordable, but it is in no way sustainable. Frequently, it's in no way ethical. Possibly something you might get on Etsy, it might be affordable, it might be sustainable, and it's probably ethically made, but unfortunately, it just always isn't fashionable. And if you want it fashionable, then you run into affordability issues. Two Pink Peas, on the other hand, meets all three. It's not just a marketing ploy, it truly is who we are. There's a criterion we put for every purse before we put it out for sale. Now marketing. Most of our marketing is social media, our Instagram and our Facebook page, although we do have Twitter and Snapchat as well, as well as pop-up shops. We did our first pop-up shop at a Latte Cafe in November, and it was a success, so we plan on doing more in the future at other local coffee shops because they hit our demographic exactly where they are. And besides, who doesn't want to get coffee and look at fashion? I mean, come on, it's the best combination of the two. Now finances. Two Pink Peas can grow steadily without a lot of outside investment for the purpose that because we have redefined the manufacturing model, instead of just buying a lot of pre-made fabric and then sewing it, and having to pay for everything each step of the way, by using recycled fabric, we get to get it at a much lower cost and therefore we get to keep our prices low for consumers, as well as giving us the flexibility to make it ethically and with the most time and quality necessary to make the best purse possible. Already we have sold over $500 worth of products since May, and we projected to sell more than double that amount this year. We are on the cusp of a revolution in the fashion industry. Not only do people want things that are pretty, they want things that make the world a better place. Two Big Peace is poised to become a market leader in this area, and it has the possibility to shake up the accessories industry. While the clothing industry is starting to catch on to the sustainable and ethically made concept, accessories are far behind, and we are very much ahead of the curve. Thank you so much for coming today. It was a pleasure speaking to you.